Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to be showing you guys the best reagent farming loop to get cattails, which can be transmuted into water lilies, and frost flowers, which can be transmuted into grendelweed. Now if you don't know what a reagent loop is, I'll explain it to you really quickly here. So basically, in the game, you know, there's all these different realms, and you can switch between them, but you have to wait a minute before switching again. And in each realm, the reagents are all there, like respawned, and so by switching between realms you're able to pick up the reagents in the same place without having to wait for them to respawn in the same realm. And uh, in the loop, we're going to be transferring between two areas in the same realm to get the maximum of reagents that we can within a single minute, and so then after that minute runs up, we can then transfer into a new area into a new realm and so that we can pick up the reagents again so you're just constantly moving constantly picking up reagents for an entire minute and you're able to do it infinitely because you won't run out of mana or anything you can just keep doing it until you feel like stopping and get as many reagents as you want so in this loop in particular we're going to be able to get six cattails and three frost flowers guaranteed and each of those can drop anywhere from one to three of those reagents so that's really nice and on top of that they can drop rare harvests as well and so the cattails rare harvests are kelp and water lilies and the frost flowers rare harvest is grendelweed now on this loop you can also get an ore on each rotation but it's not really something that's going to be a priority it's just kind of something that if we walk by it and pick it up then it's nice you can also get a diamond from that if you're really lucky but this isn't a guide on focusing on getting ore I can make another one on ore but I never miss an opportunity to get extra reagents. So in preparation for this video, I did a half hour of farming on this loop, uh, 30 minutes, so like 30 cycles, uh, just to see what I would get from it. I emptied all the reagents on this character that I could, and so that you could see them all on one page here. I couldn't transfer the grenadiers because they're no transfer, but I took everything else off, and this is what I got in a half hour of farming. I got 261 cattails, 136 frost flowers, 13 kelp, 19 ore, 8 grendelweed, and 18 water lilies. And I think that's pretty fantastic for only a half hour of farming. And so, uh, let me go ahead, let's go ahead and start the loop now. I'm going to do a couple rotations of it just to show you guys how it works. So, we're in Grizzleheim, this is where we're going to do at, and we're going to go ahead and head over to Merkholm Keep. So let's go ahead and walk over there. And once we're in here, we're going to take the pink teleporter, or red teleporter, whatever color you want to call it, to the Grendel Grotto. And then we're just going to take a left down to this little pond. And you can see this is where my location is marked. I like to mark my location right here because it's where a cattail can be. And I just like to mark it in the same place every time so that it's as consistent as, consistent as possible. So basically, once you get here, you're going to start in a realm and then decide what order you want to go through through all the realms. It doesn't really matter, just whatever works. As long as you're going into a different realm each minute and that and as long as you can remember which ones you've been in. But once you get here, you're going to just walk around this pool and then the, there's always going to be two frost flowers and three cattails. So just walk around and get them. See, I already got a water lily from that cattail and a kelp from that one. All right, so we got all the rages from here. Then you're going to teleport to Northgard, and here you're going to take a left from the main part and just walk up this hill. Sometimes there can be an ore right there. If there is, then you, I would recommend picking it up. Then we come back into this little lake area. There's always three cattails back in here. They can be anywhere in this water, in the, uh, in the back water that is. There's one of them, two, so someone must have taken the third one because there's also usually a frost flower there too, but it wasn't there, but that's okay. And we're going to go ahead and teleport back to Merkholm Keep now, and it's very important to remember that whatever realm you mark your location in, you're going to go back to that realm. So I marked my location in Realm Diego, so I'm going to go back to that realm. So always. Uh, teleport to your location and then change realms right after and then mark your location again. Don't mark your location in the old realm because then you'll teleport back to the old realm even if you switch realms. So now we're here again, we're gonna go ahead and pick up all the rages in the pool. Two frost flowers and three cattails. 
and then go back to Northgard. Take a left. Um, try to pick up two mana, uh, mana orbs each time because then you'll never run out of mana. If you can't, that's okay because you can always make up for it later. But if you always grab two, then you'll never run out. So there's the frost flower. I got one cattail, two cattails, and the third cattail. The ore can also be right there in that little area, and it can also be up there. But if it's not there, then just go ahead and teleport back and continue the cycle. Probably you're going to do this just a couple more times before ending the video. Yeah, we come back, switch realms, then mark our location again, and start picking up the reagents. Back to Northgard. Take a left. There's some mist wood. Oh look, here's the ore that can also be right there. Got our cattail right here. Another one here. Frost flower here. And I'm gonna guess the last cattail was picked up by that girl back who was fishing, because she was right by one of the respawn points. We're gonna go ahead and teleport back to Markholm Keep. Switch realms. Mark the location, and then pick up the reagents. Grendelweed, that's pretty good. Can have that mana. Cattail right here. Here. Sometimes they're like all three right there. Another one right here. And look, there's the ore. And yeah, we got a water lily. Oh, and a frost flower. And the ore. Sometimes they're like on top of each other there. And that's all three. And I think this will be our last rotation for the video. Let's see if we can get anything else good. To Northgard, one last time. Take a left. Check for the cattail. And just to show that it, that it, that this is just under a minute, like you can still see, we have about 20 seconds left on the timer still. So I'm gonna guess that she just took the reagents that yeah that were supposed to be here, which is okay. You know, if other people are farming too, that's cool. But yeah, I think that'll do it for this video. I hope that you guys found this helpful. Hopefully you guys can get all your cattail, grendelweed, frost flower, water lilies, all that jazz. Um, good luck on the rest of your adventures and have a good rest of your day and I will see you guys next time.